Hi, I'm Jeff Ludy, the owner of Houston Window Experts, uh, and on today's video, we just happened to drop in on a project uh, not too far from our office, which is in Garden Oaks area. To this house, it's a beautiful house. We have uh, a wonderful homeowner here who's had us to come out because they love the house, but they just, actually the windows are fine, but they hate the way the windows look on the back of the house. That's good enough reason for me. <laughs> we love replacing windows, even if they're working fine. But in this particular case, I have this beautiful uh, backyard. It's like so serene and they've got a nice outdoor area, beautiful TV. This is fairly new construction. These are already double pane windows, but they just didn't like how all these bars are dividing up the view from the inside looking out. So in this case, we're just basically gonna lose these windows. There's three of them like this, three big windows across the back. And we're gonna put in some beautiful, lots of glass, very little frame, make it even a little bump up on the level of contemporary uh, appeal to this house, but also make sure that it's also energy efficient. It's gonna be quieter because they can hear weed eaters and things like that from neighbors. And we're gonna put in a window that's actually a little better insulated and a lot better performing, and it's gonna make things more beautiful. So let's come closer and take a look. I'll show you what we're doing over here. So this is Don Juan. Don Juan's been working for, how long have you been working for us? About seven years. Almost seven years. And uh, you went through the AMA certification, didn't you? That's right. So uh, Don, oh, I should be putting this on, we'll get close to the house, sorry. Don Juan is a, a certified, AMA certified master installer. What does that mean? Okay, just like you can be a master plumber or a master electrician, in my industry, you can be a master installer certified by AMA, American Architectural Manufacturers Association. So this guy knows what he's doing, he's really good at it. All of our guys are great at it, but um, what are you gonna do now? You're basically, you took the glass out, right? That's right, we're about to cut the frame to make it weaker so that we can take it out. Okay. And so, eventually be able to put in the window. Okay, so in this case, we already took out the glass. You can see over there, the guys are, are taking out the glass on the other unit. And now that the glass is out, we need to find a way to collapse down this frame. And we wanna do it in a way that's safe for the home and also that doesn't damage the stucco. Because if you notice here, this is stucco. And stucco is very brittle. And stucco can actually crack and chip. It takes an expert. <laughs> get it? Houston window expert. It takes an expert to be able to do this without causing damage to the house. So we'll watch this for a second. And then we'll come back after we kind of got it popped out and show you what's going on. Go ahead. Show them what you're doing. Close, I want you to see something that we did. This is really, really important. Look at all that plastic. Look, see? Whole, everything's covered up. We got plastic all over that. Taking care of the house, you know, it's, it's one thing to know what you're doing. It's one thing to do what you do well and to do it in a way that's safe for the homeowner, protecting their house. And that's the Houston Window Experts difference. So you continue on. We'll come back in a little bit and we'll get you some after photos. Okay, so now that we've got the frame itself out, I want to show you what we're doing here. If you notice know there's, we, we need the opening real clean and smooth right here. But you can see where some of that stucco actually is, is sticking in over to the side. And you know why that happened? Is because if you look at the old frame, let me show you the old frame. Here's the old frame. You see this cavity right here? So basically that was in there and then, and then it was like that. And see all this cavity here allowed some of that mortar that they used to get back inside. Now this is where an amateur wouldn't know any better. An amateur would say, oh man, I'm worried about this and there's gonna be junk behind there. So I'll just order the window small, like an inch too small. And that way I can just put trim pieces around it. Well, what I don't like about that is the homeowner paid for more glass. That's the whole reason we're even here. If we were gonna leave this in there or we're gonna make the window downsize in order to accommodate uh, our convenience instead of their uh, home, if we did prioritize that, then, then yeah, we save some time. And you know, it'd actually be a cheaper install. And oh, let's save some money. Let's go with the company that doesn't do it right. No one ever said that, but that's what they said when they didn't pick an expert. So now that that's out, this is our problem. This sticks, this sticks into where our window's gonna go. We wanna give these people wall-to-wall -wall glass. So come around here, I want you to see it. So you can see just how far that sticks in. See that right there? See, that's, that's in the way. The window needs to go all the way to the edge here, and that's not gonna do it. So 
let me show you what we're gonna do. I hope my competitors are busy somewhere else not watching this video. But go ahead and show them, show them what you're gonna do to make that right. And you see, look, we got this up so we can block, uh, block the stuff from going into the house, taking care of things. So come back over this way for just a minute. So I want to get where I can breathe and talk at the same time. Obviously, this is filmed right in the heat of COVID and the heat of Houston. You can tell I'm sweaty. There's a lot of times that people say to me, Jeff, I check you guys out, I love what you're doing, but you know, you cost more than the other guy. You're you're like 20% higher than the other guy. Why why is that? And, uh, and I have to answer it like this. There's quality you can see, and there's quality you can't see. This is quality you can't see. This is the stuff that, you know, when you're at work doing your job, we're here doing our job, you come home, everything looks great. You don't realize that there was a difference between a uh, guy with do-it-yourself level skill sets and people who do this for a living. You know we install nearly 15,000 windows a year in Houston alone. So you get you get pretty good at what you do because you've done it a lot and you're really experienced at it. Also, by the way, our crews, they don't get paid by how many windows they can get in in one day. They don't get paid by the window. They get paid by the hour. So there's no incentive to say, let's do this fast. Let's cut corners. Let's not chip this out. Let's undersize the window. Because the more windows I can put in in one day, the more money I'm going to make on this job. That's not the way we see it. We treat people in their home the way we would want our homes to be treated. And that's the difference between us and our competitors. So anyway, enough. That I got on my high horse. I love talking about that because we are a different kind of window company, different in the sense that we feel like we're better. Not better people, there's great people out there doing what we do, but we're, we're experienced at this and we're really good at what we do. So we'll come back in a few minutes when we're putting the new window in so you can see how that looks too. So when I talked about like the difference between Houston Window Experts and, and our competitors, I mentioned several things, but one of them is this. Look, check this out. There's a, here's a swimming pool really close to the house. And we see this a lot in Houston, especially in uh, like say Montrose and um, the heights and places where the houses are kind of a little bit closer together. You've got to build your pool pretty close to the house if you want to get much pool. So that's what they've done here. And you know, when we're about to do some work here that we know is going to get a little sloppy, we're going to basically come and we're going to put some plastic and we're going to actually come out over onto the pool with it. We're going to take it down to the sides so we can collect anything that might accidentally get into that. I tell people all the time, if you don't hire the right person to do your windows, you'll find glass in your pool, uh, you'll find glass on your puppy's feet, you'll find glass uh, in your feet. I mean, it's like when you take glass out, sometimes it, sometimes you get a little bit of a problem and it kind of goes somewhere and it breaks and it shatters a little bit. And so, you know, covering stuff up is gonna be critically important. So you're gonna see what they do here. It's really, really cool stuff. And I think you're gonna love it. Okay, so we're all done. We got the first one in. And I've got to go back to the office and check emails, but we got this in. It looks really great. Remember I told you how we chiseled everything out? Now you can see how the window goes all the way to the very edge instead of starting up here. So lots of glass, very little frame. Now all we've got to do now is we're going to inject foam into this to seal it really well against the house. And then we're going to put a, a really nice 30-year caulk on this so that it'll last for a very, very, very long time. It's going to be beautiful. Get to enjoy the indoors and outdoors without the obstruction. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.